Hola guys, welcome back to TLE TV and today we're going to be doing an Indian food mukbang. What you say now? What you do now? TLE and we back with the crew now. Crab shrimp and you know we review now. Cooking up all this real nice food now. What you said now? What you need now? Mukbang green screen HD now. Go ahead and subscribe, join the family. TLE is the place to be. Alright y'all, so here I have some samosas, some tiki marsala chicken with some, is it basmati rice, I believe? I'm not sure. But the thing is, is this fresh or frozen? All right, y'all, so I'm doing a comparison video on fresh and frozen food. I know I did one before with the Nathan, um, what it was it? The Auntie Annie's, Nathan's hot dogs. I did one on those and I was saying the comparison and the fresh one that you get out of the mall and then the one that you get frozen. So today it's going to be Indian food. So I'm going to stick a clip right in here how I prepared this and the name of it so you guys can know if you want to go pick it up. Okay guys, so this is what it looks like. They're made by Tandoor Chef. So this is the chicken tiki masala. Let me turn this off. Okay, so this is the chicken tiki masala. And this is the chicken samosas. So yeah, we're going to be tasting these and comparing these to the flavor of these authentic dishes. And letting you guys know which ones we like better or if it's the same or less or whatever. So this is the brand and that's what it looks like. Okay, for the chicken samosas, it does give you the option to deep fry them. Um for four to five minutes or into golden brown, turning occasionally. So I'm at, I have them over here. Okay, so I took the um, chicken marsala out of the oven. That's what it looks like there. And then I'm done with the samosas. And I'm gonna get ready to plate it. Okay, y'all, so this is the final product. Now let's get to tasting. All right, y'all, so back this is it plated so my samosas y'all don't be talking don't be coming for my samosas i already know that they they're a little dark <laughs> i did i had the oil a little bit too high i was doing other things um and i let it get too hot apparently so it was a little bit too high but it's still, it's okay we're gonna work with it but i have the samosas here these are chicken samosas and then i have the tiki masala chicken with the boss money with the boss Whoops. With the basmati rice, today the drink, I have brisk in the building. Today I have fruit punch. And I have a glass of ice over here. So let me go ahead and bless the food. Lord, thank you for this food. You bless me as you bless me as I eat it. Bless me and to my body. Please don't let any hurt, harm, or danger come to me for this food or drinking and strike your son. Just say my pray. Amen. So let me go ahead and pour my drink. I thought it would be colder in here. Or colder than this because I had it in the freezer. But apparently not long enough. I've never had the fruit punch, guys, either. So this is new. Hopefully it's good. My favorite is the strawberry melon. All right. So y'all, before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Tinley TV because it is the place to be. Don't forget to check the description box down below for the Epic Empire family. And don't forget to check the description box for It's So Naya, which is Naya's channel that she has started. Go ahead and check her out if you can for me, please. All right, y'all, so excuse my eyes if they look a little red. Um, I think when I was looking, um, I saw my eye is red. I think something got in it. So I'm not tired, I'm not sleepy. I'm just, my eyes are irritated. So sorry about that. So yeah, let's get started with the samosa. Now I have had this before. Um, I've had these dinners before, or this particular dinner before, but I've never fried the samosas. So let me see. Oh, it's warm. That's what it looks like on the inside. If y'all can see. And the inside ain't take a stuffer. So I don't have any of the, um, you know the little, I can't think of the sauce name. And I know, mm, no, this is good. It's the green sauce. I can't think of the name right now. Somebody will put it down in the comments. Mmm. <laughs> Y'all, this is bomb. I know it's a little Cajun. It's a little Cajun. You know, people say that when they burn stuff, they call it Cajun. 
Sorry guys, the cart was full. But I was saying that this is really good in the tiki marsala sauce. Mmm. These chicken samosas. They are so much like the real thing. With rice. And the chicken. Oh my god. It's the all white meat chicken. You see it? Hope y'all can see that. Hope it's focused. So, as you see, I put this in the oven. <clears throat> so let it cook, but the purpose of these videos are to test the fresh and frozen to see if it's even worth spending your money on. So I'm the tester for you, and I can tell you guys if it's worth spending your money on. Some stuff just can't be frozen; it's just not good. Some stuff is okay, and some stuff. Like this, for instance, is great. Oh my god. If y'all put this, if you put this on a plate and never told me that you got this frozen out of a box, I would think it's authentic Indian food. And I'm not kidding. I forget the name of the uh, company, but y'all. I put it in the beginning. I would notate it, but oh my god. Y'all, y'all are bomb. Now I've had Indian food before. Twice. And it tastes just like the real thing. Mmm. I was said the first time I had this. I put these in the oven. I didn't fry them. Mm. Next time I'll put them in the oven. Ugh. Oh my god, the sauce. I want more sauce. And I'm not even like a huge sauce person, but this sauce is good. Mmm. I think it's Lindor Chef or Chef something. Oh, good. Oh, the brisk fruit punch is good. It's good. Wow. That's really good. Never had that one. Mmm. Y'all know I miss you, right? Just a messy eater. Just a messy eater. And y'all, yes, I do have clothes on. Don't need y'all to be like, I was naked eating. It's just a halter top. It's a halter top, okay? Let's not spread rumors. <laughs> Shout out to Ryan and Eating Pretty ASMR or Eating Pretty Mukbangs. Mmm. But it is good. You don't even need to fry these. Just put them in the oven. So, I think it's Tandoor Chef. But, if you have tried the Indian food, y'all let me know in the comments. This stuff is bomb. Mm. 
I think enough frozen food could be so good. My food like this. I'm gonna have to buy that brisk more often. They doing their thing. I wish I could let y'all taste it. Mmm. Mmm. The chutney. That's the name of the green stuff. I knew it was going to come to me. I wish I had some of that. Further uh, samosa. That stuff is good. Sometimes it's spicy though. This food has a hint of spice to it. I can hear it. But not too much. The chicken that they use, like, I think these meals cost like five something, five dollars or something, but they're worth every penny. I will pay for these. The chicken is all white meat. You know how sometimes they say all white meat chicken and it has fillers in it or gristle or whatever. You can tell they mix with other stuff. This is not mixed with anything else. This is all white meat and I'm not paid or sponsored to say this. It's giving props for props to do. Mmm. And it's fulfilling. Mmm, I'm so It's fulfilling. Like the samosas, they come, it's eight of them. And they come four in a pack so you can cook four at a time. But I just, you know, made all eight for the video. Well. Four of those with this. That's a meal. That's good. And they have other products that I'll probably try in the future. Now this is a winning winner. Chicken dinner. If you haven't had any food before, this is a good way to try it out. They use so many different spices and herbs and stuff. So many different kinds. Their flavors are so like... What's the word I'm looking for? Developed. Like, the flavors are so developed. They're so good like they're intricate they're not just like dull notes they have really good flavors in their food mm. Mm. Yummy. Yeah, mm. All right, y'all. So that's it for the this versus that video. The frozen versus fresh. 
Um, in this case, I definitely would give this five thumbs up out of a scale of one to five. This was delicious, absolutely delicious, guys. As you know, because I kept saying it over and over in the video. So I would definitely recommend you guys go check out this product. Um, I think it's Tendor Chef or something like that. I made sure to notate it in the video so you guys can check it out and see. Or if not, you can see it in the beginning. Um, yeah, I definitely would recommend it. And I'm so glad I tried this. Like, I'm so glad I picked it up. If you do try this or if you have tried it, make sure to leave a comment down below letting me know what you think of these products. Do you think it's comparable to authentic Indian food or do you just think it was a sad try? I don't know. I love it. So let me know what you think. Again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Tinley TV because it is the place to be. Don't forget to check the description box for the Epic Empire family as well as It's Sonaya. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.